Hello everybody and welcome to the first ever, well not first ever, I should say more of the second part of my playthrough of the Final Fantasy VII with my fellow YouTubers as the characters. Now, you must be thinking to yourself, Luke, you sound so much different, you sound so much clearer and so much brighter. Well, I happened to get a HyperX headset for Christmas, so I, whoever bought me that, I'm not going to put their name out there, but thank you. So, not only will you guys not hear me tapping on my keyboard, but you will also hear me soothingly and clearly. And also, I was watching the last episode, and I noticed my game audio was quite low. Um, so I turned it up. Hopefully you guys can hear it. As a matter of fact, I'm going to do this. You guys should be able to hear that game audio just fine. So, let's uh, go on ahead and... Um, Let's just boot it up. Let's start off where we left off. So, last time in our series, we were just got done blowing up the first reactor, and we were in now we're in the Sector 7 slums. So, that's uh, the avalanche hideout there. <laughs> you want to meet your little baby? Little baby? Hey, don't think you'll know what I mean. I'm telling you. Alright, well, Bear, I need you to move, I say. I don't know why you're still sitting around, dude. Okay, go on ahead. Papa! Marlene, are you gonna say anything to Cloud, aka Kyo Man 717 which really needs to get changed in the Necro mascot ASAP? Welcome home, Kyo. Looks like everything went well. Did you fight with Blackfist? Yeah. I should have known. He's always pushing people around. You've always been in fights ever since you were little. I was worried. So, since we really don't have a, a girl in our group... That's who this gets to be. No, Dylan. You're not allowed to be part of this. By the way, for all the people who are wondering, who's Dylan? Who's this mysterious man? Dylan is my younger brother, and I happen to be in the same room with him as I am recording. So, uh, there you go. So, let's go ahead and start off this character name right here this is kind of an inside joke but we're gonna we're gonna add it anyways he's my yo i've been up since eight o'clock this morning also i also wanted to wish you all happy holidays while well, i had the chance flowers how nice you're almost never see them here in the slums but a flower for me? Oh, Keo, you shouldn't have. I'm gonna give it to Marlene just to be a total a-hole. That's exactly what I should do. But no, but I gotta give it to Megan. Thank you, it smells wonderful. Maybe I should fill the store with flowers. See, that is why you get the flowers. Because that thing will trigger something. I know it will. Mm-hmm. Welcome home. You are right, Blackfist. Great. Get in here, fools. We starting this meeting. Give me a test a moment. <laughs> Hmm. 
Let's just go ahead and talk to Blackfist, punching everything he can. Yo, Kyo, there's something I want to ask you. Was there anyone from a soldier fighting us today? None. I'm positive. You sound pretty sure. If there was anyone from soldier, you wouldn't be standing here now. Don't go thinking you just you so bad just because you wasn't soldier. <laughs> yeah, you strong. Probably all them guys in soldier are, but don't forget that skinny. A word because you know profanity is just not allowed on the strip this anymore. Working for Avalanche now. Don't get no ideas about hanging on to Shimra. Staying with Shimra? You asked me a question, I answered it. That's all. I'm going upstairs. I want to talk about my money. Yeah, I want to talk about my money. Wait, Keo. Megan, let him go. Looks like he still misses the Shimra. Shut up. I don't care about neither Shimra nor Soldier. But don't get me wrong, I don't care about Avalanche or the planet for that matter. Listen, I'm asking you, please join us. Sorry. The planet is science, Lib is surely saying someone has to do something. So let Black Fist and his buddies do something about it. It's got nothing to do with me. So, you're really leaving? You're just gonna walk right out ignoring your childhood friend? What? How can you say that? You forgot the promise, too. Promise? So you did forget. Remember? It was seven years ago. I didn't know Megan seven years ago. Been there. Look, the well, do you remember? Yeah, back then. I thought you would never come, and I was getting a little cold. I'm just doing a time check, don't worry. Because I told you guys, we're trying to keep this at a, around a 20 to 30 minute period, 20 to 25 minute period if I can. Sorry I'm late. Don't you should hand me some of them bugles. If you're a good boy, you will. And of course, I get flipped off. <whistles> Alrighty, well, let's see. I want to join Soldier. I'm going to be the best there is, just like Sephiroth. Sephiroth? The great Sephiroth? Isn't it hard to join Soldier? I probably won't be able to come back to this town for a while. Sorry, my voice acting isn't up to par. Huh? If you make it, will you be in the newspapers? I'll try. Hey, let's make a promise. Um... If you get really famous and I'm ever in a bind, you'll come save me, alright? What? If I'm ever in trouble, my hero will come and rescue me. I want to experience that at least once. What? Come on, promise me. Alright. I promise. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I just realized this whistling and humming might be actually really bad for your ears, even with the mic I have. <sighs> of course, DFX. You remember now, don't you, our promise. I'm not a hero, I'm not famous, so I can't keep our promise. But you got your childhood dream, didn't you? You joined Soldier. So come on, you've got to keep your promise. I like how Barrett climbed the thing, like he didn't even need the pinball sheet. Blackfish was just like... 
Wait a second, big time soldier. A promise is a promise. Here. Received Black Fist Dash. 1500 ago. You know, Black Fist, I thought you'd have been richer than that. This is my pay. Don't make me laugh. What? Then you'll. You got the next mission lined up. I'll do it for 3000 What? It's okay. It's okay. Psst. We're really hurting for help, right? Uh, that's money for Marlene's schooling. 2000 Thanks, Keo. And this is the sleep period. So we're getting some storyline here and stuff. And now we're actually about to get introduced to the most important mechanic of Final Fantasy VII. One of, if not the most important mechanic. <laughs> Our target's the Sector 5 reactor. Head for the station first. If I'll find, I'll fill you in on the train. Yo, Kilo, before the next session, I got something I want to ask you. I, uh, I don't know really how to use materia. Well, what else is there? I'll give you the material we found. Just teach me how to use it. Okay, I'll explain it. Sure, I'll explain how materia works. I know how material works. I'll just feel basically you put a material that like they're usually different colors and different colors mean different things. So like green is magic, yellow is a skill, blue is like a thing that affects your weapons, red is a summon. So they're showing you now look at my weapon here, it has two slots. Now each slot can be a different thing. If they're joined together means you can make like combinations. If they're not joined together, you basically can't make a combination. So what they're doing is he's using restore on the buster sword slot. It really doesn't make a difference where you put certain materia at. Um, but they do affect your set. So say I put a green one on my buster sword, my magic will get stronger and my max MP will be stronger. But my max HP and my strength will go down. Now, people like Cloud you usually put strength. So you put like summons, um, some purple material. Purple materials like max HP increase, uh, max. I think it's like Chocobo luck or something like that. It helps you get Chocobo, you know, kind of self explanatory. But it's, um, you know, this is teaching you like the different kinds of materia that there are. So, what we're going to do is. Excuse me, i am told you guys, I've been up since 8. And that's what there is to equip material, essentially. Just to see, it wasn't that tough. Okay. When you want to remove material, you just hit the cancel button, I think it's pretty sure. Oh, push menu. There you go. That's just one thing you have to be careful of. Whenever you equip material, your situation changes. Parts of you may become stronger. While others get weaker. Not only when you equip magic material, your magic power will get stronger, but your physical strength weakens. So people like Cloud, Vincent, Tifa should not have magic. Should solely just be strength stuff. Um, Red 13 is all along the lines of that. Um, personally, myself, um, if it were me, I would be having um, people like uh, Barrett, Sid, um, Yuffie, Kate Sif with the magical um, MP. So, uh, well, magical materia, I should say. So they would be getting like to restore and stuff. Um, Barrett can kind of get it because what his ultimate weapon is here. The more max MP. You know, what is it? Um, the more max MP the Barrett's has. Oh, I have to go up to this weapon shop guy. So the weapon shop guy supposedly has something for you this way. So you can get weapons here. 
We buy everybody an iron pangle. Barrel already has the assault gun. It's good to carry at least two, three to five grenades. So I carry like a little bit of what's the one I'm looking for? Like no, go back up. Just in here. Yeah, there you go. Oh, okay. Hmm. Okay. That's cool. Um, I don't need to know about elementals. So sense material the yellow material which increases your skill. Um let's see. So it's gonna hang it down here. This is a fabled save point. Well apparently I'm uh then this should be all I need to know about the save point. I'll probably see you again somewhere down the road, take care. I'm gonna just, just be in there to make sure you keep an eye out for me. Oh, well, I make sure I keep an eye out for you. Right. Receiving all material. Hey, you got one right off. That was material. Next time, take this treasure. Proceed in ether. Now listen, in these chests are a lot of items. There are box safes and bag safes. Make sure you don't overlook any. Okay. So, is that all material? Remember how on Cloud, when you equip the material? Oh, actually, we need, while we're here, I should equip these bangles to them. So, notice on the assault gun it says, like, see, so I have all and restore. So, what's going to happen here is the next time Barrett uses, or Blackfist uses, um, restore, it not only will heal himself, but it'll heal others. And that's what you want because it will progress actually the leveling of your material a little faster. So, that's what we want. I'm just going to make sure I have lightning and ice. It's pretty good as teeth I have any. Oh, uh, she's got none. Feels bad, man. Alrighty, let's go ahead and take a look upstairs, because apparently this dude's got something for us up here. Oh yeah, here we are. This is a sun, so I don't think you can stay for free. What are you gonna do? Doesn't... <laughs> no way. Tough guy, huh? You better sleep I could, you better save when you can ask to me and tough. Remember that old dude. Just make sure it's like nothing crazy around here. I never used to look on my other save files, so I always now look whenever I play a new game. Be like, oh, hey, I didn't notice this before here, and you know, kind of stuff. <laughs> you dried up a little easier. You tired of all the rest of the third floor in my house. Just wanted to give me some cash. Nothing. <laughs> Same. <laughs> He'll forget about it. Oh, you. Get my friend on the second floor to teach you. <laughs> Medicine's good too. We need to get some medicine while we're here. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to get some of these materia. So we have ice. We have restore. We have all of them essentially. We just need some phoenix downs. Couple potions. I just be stocked up on my all of my stuff because you never know what kind of fight you're gonna get into. So this is what I'm doing. So now we're really gonna go ahead and save. Oh, here we go with the DFX again. And let's see where I'm at in the video. 
Yep, so I think this is where we're gonna save here real quick, and then we'll, uh, I'll be back with the other episode. And I hope you guys have a good one next one.